Once again, you are welcome to the ultimate voyage through the fabric of human existence. Culture Scarps Trekking. Join us as we take you on an exciting journey through times, revealing the secrets of the past, present, and even the mysterious passageways of prehistoric times as we go across the cosmos and explore the core of human history, culture, and the collective memory. A testament to the indomitable spirit of Zulu warriors and indomitable spirit of every year, the ethos of a people unyielding in the face of adversity. Military prowess finally on becomes a legacy etched in the annals of time, an enduring testament to the Zulu tenacity that echoes through the ages. As the literary odyssey unfolds, the Zulu narrative invites contemplation, a journey into the rich and expansive epic that defies the constraints of temporal boundaries. The Zulu legacy it adapts to the anchored in the cultural bedrock to defines the Zulu people persists an epic saga that beckons the world to explore its depths and appreciate the enduring spirit of a people. As much as there are some scattered Zulu-speaking people all over the provinces, majority of the Zulu-speaking people all over the provinces, majority of the Zulu-speaking people live in KwaZulu, natal province in South Africa, or have migrated initially from the stellar Africa, since of Africa. The home of the Zulu tribe. He is Zulu tribe speaks their language which is known as a Zizulu. A widely spoken language in South Africa. It mostly features respect terms. For example, there are words used while addressing elderly people. Using first names on an elderly person is normally frowned upon by the tribe and instead they use terms such as Baba for father and Mama for mother even when the senior individuals are not the parents of the person in them. Dead. The tribe also believes in the existence of a higher being who they refer to as Umvelakangi meaning one who came first. This highest being is believed to be far removed from the people as lives and that no one has ever set eyes on him. They believe that there is some mediation between the spirits of the dead and the one who came first for the people alive on earth. The narrative unfurls, delving into the intricate folds of Zulu cosmology where spirituality intertwines with dreams. Interconnected spirits breathe life into rituals that bind the living with the departed. Sangamas, revered traditional healers, navigate the ethereal realms, interpreting the whispers of the ancestors to heal and guide their communities. Venturing into the realm of attire, the Zulu wardrobe stands as a testament to sartorial elegance intertwined with cultural significance. Each bed meticulously threaded, every fabric choice of lineage, bright symbolic mist of the solo saying, mirrors the vivacity of the Zulu spirit, unyielding in its commitment to tradition. Education, a torchbearer of progress, illuminates the Zulu landscape, transcending the confines of conventional wisdom. From the hallowed halls of learning institutions to the ancestral passing down of wisdom, 
education becomes a conduit for empowerment and enlightenment. The Zulu pursuit of knowledge, a perpetual bonds intertwine the Zulu entrepreneurial spirit, a reflection of societal structure, harmonizes with the natural landscape. The rhythmic cadence of daily life, from communal meals to storytelling around the fire, fosters a collective consciousness that resonates beyond individual boundaries, trade and commerce. In the Zulu paradigm, extend beyond economic transactions. They embody communal economic as goods. The Zulu entrepreneurial spirit, the Zulus, as Zulus, as Zulus, as endeavors but also in the craftsmanship and artistry that define their cultural footprint. In the vast expanse of Zulu history, the echoes of battles and conquests resonate. The indomitable spirit of warriors encapsulated in the historic tales of Shaka Zulu and the Amabitho, reverberates through time. Military strategy, a fine art mastered by the Zulu story, the multifaceted hills of Kwazulu, Natal Hill, 